Did you know that Theodore Roosevelt, a former president of the United States, once survived an assassination attempt with a bullet in his chest? Here's the story. Roosevelt was at the Gilpatrick Hotel when he was shot by John Flamong Schramm. Fortunately, the bullet first hit his steel eyeglass case and a copy of his 50-page speech in his jacket pocket before lodging in his chest. Despite being shot, Roosevelt felt well because he, being an experienced hunter, believed that the bullet hadn't reached his lungs since he wasn't caught with blood. He refused immediate hospitalization <coughs> and went on to deliver his scheduled speech with blood seeping into his shirt. Subsequent x-rays revealed that the bullet had lodged in Roosevelt's chest muscle without penetrating further. It was deemed less dangerous to leave it in place than to attempt removal, possibly because of the fate of President McKinley, who died from an infected bullet wound. Roosevelt carried the bullet with him for the rest of his life. 